another day that we are acknowledging the commencement of a major investment in our country's development. Ladies and gentlemen, a key feature of a developed country is high quality infrastructure and transportation services. High quality infrastructure unlocks economic potential, ensures the, an equitable distribution of growth and opportunities throughout the country, and creates networks that binds us together. It also boosts productivity and competitiveness, allowing businesses to grow and prosper and to create employment and attract investment. This is not the only project that we are engaged in. A few days ago, a similar ceremony took place in the Valencia area, where we acknowledged the start of the upgrade of the road infrastructure from Valencia Junction expecting to end up in Toko sometime in the not too distant future and at a port in Toko. More recently, I visited the project of the highway from Komuto to Sangre Grande, observing its progress. That was one that was started two years ago, had a year in the courthouse, and a year's work has gone on there. So we went to visit the actual um, work progress in the area. What these three projects are doing in the context of this paragraph in this program is saying that we are building infrastructure to improve transportation services. And why? Because that will boost productivity, competitiveness, allowing businesses to prosper, to create employment, and once that is happening, we are on our way. Good things are happening in Trinidad and Tobago.